was the night before Christmas at 11.30 p.m. My whole family was fast asleep in their rooms while I had to sleep on the fold-out bed again. Opening presents on Christmas fell forever away, but little did I know things would change forever that day. What are you doing? Oh, hey Christian. I didn't know you were here. That's weird because when you were vacuuming you were making eye contact with me. How'd you get to the light over there? How'd you, how'd you sneak by? You're a sneaky little boy. I thought you said you didn't know I was in here. Gunnar, could you just put it away? I'm tired, man. I need to go to sleep. All done. Oh no, I forgot my hands are dirty. I gotta wash those. All done. Oh, hey, Christian. I didn't see you there. You look pretty small from down there. What are you and Gunnar thinking? You're making so much noise, you're gonna wake everybody up. Tomorrow's Christmas. Oh, uh, dude, we gave everybody else earplugs, so they'll, they'll sleep like two, two little kittens in a basket. Well, can I have some? No, because, I mean, we, we weren't really thinking of you. Could you please stop with all the noise? Never. What do you mean, never? No, this isn't caroling. Caroling is singing outside. Words, not just in here. Go Wake up, Christian. I am awake. Oh. Well, you know, I love those endings where, you know, it's, you know 
wake up and then it's all a dream, you know. But this is not one of those, you know, movies where you, you wake up and then it's, it really was a dream. It's, yeah, we're dead. Wait, you're dead? We're dead. What does that mean? Dead. But you're right, you're right here. We're ghosts. We're dead. We died on the front porch, ringing the doorbell, but she never came. Oh no, it can't be. What have I done? It's all my fault. Yeah, it's all because of you, Christian. You let us freeze out here. You know, I rang the doorbell. Rang it twice. I could have came in. The door was unlocked. But that's not what this is all about. This wasn't about coming in. It was about the Christmas courtesy. What a picture and what a day. After the grieving, I ended up A-OK. -okay. Cookies and milk and peppermint pie. It was too bad, my two family members had to die. But if I had the chance to turn back tining, I'd do the same again, because after all, I learned a valuable lesson. I was not charged for my family crimes, and that's worth more than Nicholas and I.